Hello, how are we? We're good, yes? Nice, I'm wearing a shirt. La di da. <laughs> this is actually the most I can dress up, unfortunately. A lot of people tonight are wearing suits. I'd love to be able to wear a suit, but I don't have the right build for a suit. I've got a fat neck and some shoulders. As soon as I put on a tie, I just look like a rugby league player on a coward punch charge. Just... <laughs> As soon as that top button's done up, what the fuck did you do at the casino on Sunday, mate? <laughs> Cops are looking for you, you're in trouble. I know my body type. You should know what your body type is and live accordingly. Some of you may have figured out my body type already. I've got the body of someone that was good at sports in high school, but who's played no sports since high school, you know what I mean? That's, that's old glory days rig up here. And, uh, if any of you suffer from that same affliction, good at sports in high school, but you haven't played since, you know, it comes with a level of overconfidence that'll get you in trouble in later life. <laughs> Got me in trouble last year, I was doing gigs at a ski resort. The gigs were at night, so during the day, myself and the other comedians got to ski or snowboard. I'd never been to the snow. First day there, one of the ski instructors clocks me, comes on over, he said, hey, heard it's your very first time here at the snow. Could I interest you in some skiing lessons? I was like, what? Lessons? <laughs> Mate, why the fuck would I need lessons? <laughs> I was very good at footy 15 years ago. I'll be right. <laughs> Turns out though, skiing at 30 and being good at footy at 15, two wildly different events. I was awful. <laughs> Those skills did not translate across at all. I was falling over on the flat bit. <laughs> like before the day's even begun, I'm face down in the snow. That's like going jet skiing and falling over in the car park. You know what I mean? Just call it off. <laughs> I can't ski, I can't drive. Correct response, stare back, 30 years of age, don't have a driver's license, right? But I have been doing driving lessons recently and I don't want to brag, but I'm nailing it. <laughs> yes, I'm learning in an automatic. <laughs> it's all right, I can feel the judgment, right? I'm copping it from my friends all the time. Cody, bro, why don't you learn in a manual? Because it's 2018. <laughs> why don't you churn your own butter, dickhead? the future, that's why. <laughs> Engineers have worked so hard so we don't have to go, nah, 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 nah. Just sit in there, strap up, vroom, you're off. Fuck yeah, science, get amongst it. <laughs> I'm also having a great time with the driving lessons because learning how to drive at 30 is very easy. I'm not nervous learning how to drive at 30 because I'm 30. <laughs> I've lived a life. Bad things have happened to me. You know who gets nervous learning how to drive? 16-year-olds, nothing's ever happened to them. They're like, what? I've got to do a three-point turn? <laughs> but I've got homework due tomorrow. Oh. It's like, Nick, are you afraid of a three-point turn? Nah, bro, I've had chlamydia and the tax man chase me. I don't <laughs> give a shit about a three-point turn. Ladies and gentlemen, enjoy the rest of your night. See you later, bye.